Let's break down this lamb shoulder and turn it into the most delicious piece of meat that you've ever seen. We're gonna start by trimming the fat off our lamb shoulder. So with a sharp knife, we're just gonna slowly and carefully trim off all this excess fat that we don't need, but that's gonna pack in so much flavor for our lamb. So save that and set it aside. You can get your butcher to do this, but where's the fun in that? Get a knife, practice it yourself, and have some fun with it. Now we're gonna take our fat, we're gonna lay that on the bottom of the tray. Once we've done that, we're gonna take our sharp knife and a saw and just portion up our lamb shoulder. I've done mine into four pieces, it's quite big, but again, that will depend on your lamb and how big your lamb is. You can decide how many portions you're gonna get out of it. Okay, now you've done that, we're gonna take our lamb, lay it on our beautiful tray of fat and season generously with salt. I know it looks like a lot of salt, but it's gonna need it. So be very, very generous with it because it's a big piece of meat and it's going to need to be seasoned correctly. Now we're going to pop that into the fridge and leave it there overnight. We're going to do a dry brine on this bad boy so it's going to come out super super tender. Now the next day we're going to whack our oven to the highest setting and then pop the lamb in there for about half an hour. Whilst that's going we're going to work on our vegetables and accompaniments what we're going to flavor the lamb with. So here I've got one lemon, one whole onion and about seven or eight garlic cloves. You can finely chop them, smash them, whatever you want we're gonna go in with all of that alongside some beautiful fresh rosemary now after about half an hour your lamb should get a nice color and should sound like this so the lamb's formed a nice little crust we're gonna season it generously with some oregano black pepper and a bit more salt Add one whole beer of your choosing. Just don't pour it over the lamb after you've just seasoned it, otherwise you're just gonna wash all the seasoning off. So pour to the side, please. Following that, we're gonna add in all our vegetables, the accompaniments we prepped earlier. Cover the tray with two sheets of aluminum foil. Make sure it's nice and tightly wrapped, and then it's gonna go into the oven. We're gonna drop our oven temperature to around 90 or 100 degrees Celsius. Low and slow is the way forward. We're really gonna work this lamb and break it down slowly in the oven. After about five hours, your lamb should look as beautiful as this. You can see how clean it comes off the bone, how tender this lamb is, and that's how you're gonna wow your guests and really impress them. I know it takes a long time, but it's really effortless, so it's definitely worth all the time, and you can always reheat it. So you've got lamb for at least the next week. Now all that's left to do is watch me pull this beautiful lamb apart. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you learned something new, please share it with a friend, like the video, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.